Welcome! This week's video will be dedicated to oil washes. We'll be looking at two different applications and cleanups. So, with my two test models base colors applied, let's talk about materials. I'll be using a cheap black oil paint, a synthetic brush, a palette, a pipette, and odorless oil solvents. For this first application, I went for a very diluted mix. There is no magic formula, but what I want you to look at is the consistency of the mix I test to the side. From my experience, I can see that my first mix was too thin, and the second one too thick. Finally, on the third try, I had the desired consistency. Look how the low surface tension of the oils runs into the recesses without staining our upper areas, providing us with quick definition and separation. This mix I managed actually ended up being just perfect where almost no cleaning was needed afterwards. This diluted application is perfect for models with lots of recesses. On the cape, however, as I saw some paint pulling, I snatched it up with my brush, just as in the front with another dry brush. For the second application, I went ahead and added some raw sienna to the black, and diluted it with just two drops of thinner. This provided me with a thicker, opaque coat, which I applied all over. I let the model sit for an hour before moving on to the cleanup. As I mentioned, there was not too much cleanup needed for the first diluted application. I wetted a Q-tip with a thinner and made sure to remove the excess, before going over the raised edges and removing the paint. You can remove as much as you want, and if you remove too much, the oil you previously mixed will probably still be wet for a reapplication. For the thicker mix, I used the makeup sponge. Depending on how much you wait, more or less staining will be left behind. For any harsh transitions on the wider areas, a dry brush can be used to feather them out very easily. Don't worry about the sheen, all the model is covered with oil which will end up drying eventually. In a previous video, I also did a cleanup of a thicker application with a brush soaked with thinner. I'll link the video above and I suggest you watch it as well. All in all, there are many methods of application and cleaning when working with oils, and some may work better than others depending on the surface, like the thinner one on the armor or the thicker one plus the feathering on the cape. But as you can see in both end results, you can work with whichever you prefer. After 24 hours, I'll say the models are safe to work over with acrylics, if you wish to go ahead and do some highlighting. But for me, I'll stop here. This has been my go-to method for speed painting in just two steps. If you want to see a longer and more in-depth video of me working with oils, or if you have any doubts, just let me know in the comments.